just saying, how are the lives looking? Are you still enjoying the live pop-ups? Scotty, whenever they're on, I'm listening to them and it's helped me get through the week at times when I'm just lying there feeling sorry for myself. No, I know what you, you know, mean. So. No, I don't think it's a question of that. I think you've obviously been very, very ill and I send you love and strength. No. You know? Thank you, Scotty. Strength to you. Not, the live pop-ups have been a godsend, as they always have been. It's right from the start when we had lockdown, the first lockdown, I thought that was you know, just kept everybody sane. It was something to look forward to, you know, and it was it was just really good routine. Everyone was getting into it. They built the community more. And then when you've come up with the idea about the call-ins, I think, you know, it's, it's grown from strength from strength. And it's just something that's, you know, I always look forward to every week when you do the I, I I think it will do, Karim. I've said it. I've always said it. It's just a question of getting it out there. And, uh, you know, maybe, maybe, and this is wishful thinking, but maybe we'll get some very wealthy person that says, I will promote this, and then we are in business, you know what I mean? Yeah, Scotty, as you said, there's a lot of these producers that are all robots, and they just copy each other, and it's going to take somebody with actual brains to think, um, let's get Scotty McClue uh, clue on, and let's do something different instead of all copying each other. Absolutely. A visionary we're looking for, Kareem. We're praying for a visionary to recognise what McClure can do. And as I say, I've nothing to prove. I've already proved it. We turned yes. uh, half a million quid into 26 million for somebody, <laughs> you know, and uh, I think I was calculating I've probably made close on 200 million pounds for media moguls. Fantastic. You know, so yeah. that's that's quite good money for them. So there's bound to be somebody that will say, I'll give this a go, because we're not actually talking terribly big money, you know what I mean? Correct. And it's an investment. Whatever radio station will take you on in time, it's always an investment. And you're very well known, Scotty, throughout the UK. Um, and as I said, whatever radio station you do get, on top of with your life, pop-ups and your call-ins on a Saturday, it will grow and grow and grow as it has been grown. It's a brand, isn't it? Scotty McClue is a world brand. <laughs> Absolutely, Scotty. Terry? But before, I, before yes. I go, Scotty, go I just want to say that the, 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 uh, what's happening just now in Ukraine is absolutely disgusting and it's shocking that what this that Russia is doing to these people and I really hope that the Ukrainian people will hang on in there with their leader and that's a leader if that's a leader if, if something was like to happen here Boris would be off the, in a plane straight away mm -hmm. to another country he is an absolute true leader of the people uh, and I hope that he wins this for the people of Ukraine well, I'm just uh, looking tonight, and obviously I haven't had it officially confirmed, but I'm hearing rumours that uh, the world leaders are going to meet with Mr. Putin and see if they can sort it out. Yes, yes. You know, well, and that, that, would, be, that would be the winner. There's Andrew yes. asking, where did the track 